Popcorn's exclusive sponsor is Flame and Skewers Mediterranean Restaurant. Welcome back to Popcorn. I'm Karen Hua, and we're here to paint party today. We're at Corks and Strokes in downtown Bakersfield. I'm gonna invite in my friend Deanna here. She is the owner. Tell me about what Corks and Strokes is all about. So we are a BYO paint studio. You can bring your own drinks, which includes alcohol, bring your wine, bring your beer, bring your champagne. Ooh. And we teach you step by step how to recreate the painting of the evening. So we have artists that are here local. We have several. Some of them are actually commissioned for their work. They're very professional artists. Wow. And we have other artists who have literally just been to so many of our classes. How many of you have ever been to a paint party before? And they're now teaching our paint parties. First and foremost, we are all here to paint all hollows, which is up here behind me on the wall. I'm gonna be here throughout the entire thing. I'm walking you through it step by step, and everybody will be walking out of here with a smile on their face, I promise. Keep in mind, they are not all going to look the same. None of them are going to look exactly like that one. We take anyone from people who paint better than our instructors once they get here to people who promise me that they can't even draw a stick figure and those people we like to prove wrong. Don't compare your work to your neighbors because everybody has their own interpretation of art. First things first, make sure you don't dip your paintbrushes in your drink cups there tonight. First thing we're gonna do is create our pumpkin stack, a semi-C. If you have to go back over it, that's fine, it's just chalk. We're gonna come on with our next pumpkin and we want this guy to be a little bit squatty. So when you're first trying to get the paint on the canvas, there's really no particular stroke that you need to worry about. Just follow the lines. You just wanna define that a touch more. You are going to probably notice that all of your strokes and all of your steps are similar to the strokes you made in the step before. So your marks will flow very well. You can pick up a touch more yellow on your brush or a touch more orange depending on your, your preference. You're doing great, honey. You're doing great. <laughs> You've already got the orange. Now pull in some yellow, just to blend any of those hollow spots. All right, so go ahead and rinse all of that orange and yellow and red out of your brush. Now it's all about highlights. bird. All right, here it is. What do we think? I'm no artist, but I did my best. I had a great time. Tina was great. This class was great. And now we have something spooky and witchy just in time for Halloween. Tell people how they can get involved, how they can sign up. We're at Corks and Strokes on Facebook, or our website is corksandstrokes.com. You go there, you either choose a date that you're available or you choose a painting that you just can't live without. Most of our tickets are $25. Thank you all so much for painting and drinking with us tonight. I'll catch you back here next Friday at noon for another episode of Pop Curd. Does this look like a bird? Does this look like a crow? Ooh! <laughs>